Today we are going to discuss the Randall Coat of Arms. But before we get started, we wanted to let you know that we offer genealogy research service at our website. Please visit us at coadb.com. First Randall Coat of Arms to discuss is blazoned gules on a cross argent five mullets sable crest and antelopes head cooped or this is for the randall family of wiltshire england the arms was borne by sir john randolph a related surname of wiltshire during the 14th or 13th centuries and the arms was borne by bernard randall alive in the year 1583 who was sergeant at law of the city of London. Similar coat of arms with the mullets pierced. This is for the Randalls or Randolphs of Aylesford in County Kent. Edward Randolph received and sold a manor of Aylesford in the year or around the year 1598. It was also born by the Randalls of Chatley in the parish of Ombersley in County Worcestershire. Richard Randall of Chatley, alive in the year 1703. Richard Randall of the Brook, who died in 1767. They were both landowners. And there was also Thomas Randall of Tappan Hall, who lived around the year 1703. Here we have one where the cross is cooped. Wasn't able to find the armature on this or the grantee. If you know, please let us know in the comments. Another, we're not sure of the armature on this one either. The author who recorded this blazon associates it with London. So I have a couple possibilities here. One is Thomas Randall of London, alive in the year 1642. John Randall Esquire of Ferry Hill and the hamlet of Eltham near London, alive in the year 1796. And Justice Randall of London, who was associated with St. Andrew's Wardrobe Church and St. Bennett's Parish. He gave money to the poor in 18, it says 1883, that, that might not be right. But these are some possibilities. Next we have Ghouls on a Cross, Argent, Five Horseshoe Sable, Crest, a Bat, Wing Sable, Expanded, I'm sorry, a Bat, Wings, Expanded Sable. This coat of arms and crest was granted before the year 1597 to Richard Randall of Walston in County Northampton and to Thomas Randall of Bonnington in County Warwickshire. Next we have Randall of Binfield in County Berkshire, England. James Randall, born 1790, Archdeacon of Berkshire and Canon of Bristol, Rector of Binfield, had son, Reverend Richard William Randall, born 1824, the Dean of Chichester, who in turn had son, Colonel Richard George Randall, of their last in Holt in County Leicestershire, born 1850, who assumed the additional surname of Bruxner. Next, Argent on a cross, Vert, five martlets of the field, crest a sheaf of wheat ore. Wasn't able to find this one. If you know, please let us know in the comments. Coat of arms of the Randall family of Northamptonshire. Arms and crest, which I don't have the crest here, it looks like. Granted in 1485 to Thomas Randall of Northampton, who was the grandfather of Edward Randall, whose coat of arms is here. Granted in 1573 to Edward Randall of London, son and heir of Vincent Randall, grandson of Thomas Randall and the who was the second son of Gilbert Randall of Hunsford in County Hertfordshire, or Hertfordshire. Next, a similar one, not stated, but it possibly could be for his son, Edward Randall of County Surrey, who was the son of Edward of London. Next, we have or a border azure for Randall of Scotland. Another Azure, a chief indented ore for John Fitz Randolph, born around the year 1325, feudal lord of Spennythorn, son of Rainolf Fitz Ralph, and also Sir Ralph Fitz Randall, born 1398, the great grandson of John. Here we have a coat of arms born by Reverend John Randall of Barry St. Edmunds, whose daughter 
Margaret died in 1727. She had married into the Shelton family. Here we have a very similar coat of arms with crest, a demi griffin, ghoul's winged orf, or Randall of Ireland. Wasn't able to find the grantee on this. If you know, please let us know in the comments. There is another one from Ireland coming up. We'll get to that later. Here's the coat of arms of a daughter of the Randall family who married William Jeremy. And another variation, this one Argent. Here we see the arms of the Earl of Moray. The tassels should be lozenge-wise here, like seen here. And uh, Thomas Randolph, born on the year 1285, first Earl of Moray, a soldier and diplomat in the Scottish War of Independence. And the herald who recorded this recorded it in the document I was looking at under the name Randall. Another for Randall of Scotland, this one with a crest and arm and armor embowed, brandishing a scimitar, all proper, the hilt affixed by the chain to the wrist of the armor. And then another one for Randall of Scotland. And on both of these, I wasn't able to find the armature. If you know, please let us know in the comments. Another for Randall or Randall of London. Per satire argent, a sable, a pale counterchange, and a fess of the second charged with two burialits of the first in an escutcheon ermine. Now, the armature wasn't stated on this one, but I do have a fairly educated guess. Based on the two burialits, George Randall, an architect who erected Parliament Bridge. Now, the bridge was erected in Cork, Ireland in 1761. And... I say that just because the burialites are sort of reminiscent of a bridge. And he was an architect, the type of man who would have um, had a coat of arms, perhaps. So I think this is the same George Randall that was born in Cork in 1717. Son of Samuel Randall, grandson of Samuel Randall, and the great-grandson of Francis Randall. Born around the year 1625, who was born in Hampshire, England died in Wexford, Ireland, and had four sons. I believe this could be the George Randall, alive in the year 1745, mentioned as a merchant, and Samuel Randall, alive in the year 1728, who were free men of the city of Cork, Ireland. We have the coat of arms of Randall of Kentisbury in County Devonshire. It's misspelled here. It says Nury. It should be Bury. And Anthony Randall of Kentisbury, Originally came from Berkshire, arms and crest confirmed, 1588. Randall of Perrin and Mevy in County Cornwall, England. Thomas Randall of Mevy, alive in the year 1620, was the second son of Thomas Randall of Perrin, and he had issue John, Thomas, William, and Catherine. Another for the Randall or Randall family, armager not stated. I have down here possibilities include Alexander Randall, alive in the year 1632 of Scotland, nephew and heir of Thomas Craig. And lastly, we have a quarterly coat of arms for Randall of Dorset. The person didn't record any other notes on this other than it being from Dorset. So I have some educated guesses of possibilities who it could be. William Randall, Member of Parliament in 1554 for Weymouth, Dorset. There's also Ambrose Randall of Sturminster in Newton Castle, Dorset, who died in 1677 and was son of Benjamin Randall of Cheriton, County Somerset. There was also George Randall of Cern Abbas, Dorset, who died in the year 1680. And here we have a list of Randalls who we didn't identify coats of arms for, but possibly could be some of the unidentified members on these slides. Nicholas Randall, a six-time member of Parliament, Matthew Randall, Lord Mayor of Bath, and so on and so forth. If you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com, link in the description. Thank you very much.